हेलो पेरेंट्स एंड गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रन वेलकम टू स्टैंडर्ड थ्री मेंटल मैथ्स क्लास टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डील विथ अ फ्यू मिक्स्ड क्वेश्चंस ऑन मेंटल मैथ्स सो लेट अस स्टार्ट विथ क्वेश्चन नंबर वन थर्टी शूज विल मेक डैश पैर वन पैर इक्वल टू टू सो थर्टी डिवाइडेड बाय टू वॉट इज द आंसर चिल्ड्रन Yes, very good. It is fifteen. In six thousand seven hundred eighty-nine, seven stands for six thousand seven hundred eighty-nine. Seven stands for seven hundred. Very good. Question number three. Take away seventy-two from the product of eight and nine. We get eight multiplied by nine is Seventy-two. So seventy-two minus seventy-two makes it zero. Now question number four. Zero into sixty-one into hundred and thirteen. Any number multiplied by zero makes it zero. Question number five. How many eights are there in thirty-two? Please count the table of eight children. Eight ones are eight. Eight twos are sixteen. Eight threes are twenty-four. Eight fours are thirty-two. So we write four. Question number six. Add twenty to fifteen and divided by seven. We get twenty plus fifteen is thirty-five. And divided by seven, we get thirty-five divided by seven is five. Counting by hundreds, write the numerals from two twenty-five to seven twenty-five. Now, two twenty-five, comma. Hundred plus two twenty-five makes it to three twenty-five. Hundred plus three twenty-five makes it to four twenty-five. We have to keep on adding hundred till we get seven twenty-five. So hundred plus four twenty-five is five twenty-five. Hundred plus five twenty-five is six twenty-five. Hundred plus six twenty-five is seven twenty-five. Very good, children. Now, question number eight. What is twice a score? One score equal to twenty. So two scores equal to twenty into two. That makes it to forty. Very good, children. Question number nine. Complete the pattern. One thousand one hundred four, one thousand one hundred six. Now the next number will be. Now. One thousand one hundred four. There is one number missing between the two two numbers. So, one thousand one hundred four, one thousand one hundred five, one thousand one hundred six. So we'll again leave one number that is one thousand one hundred seven, and the next number is. One thousand one hundred and eight. Again, the next number we leave one number one thousand one hundred and nine, and we write one thousand one hundred and ten. Question number ten: The digit having the least placed value in seven thousand eight hundred and thirty-six. So, the digit having the least placed value. So first, let us find out the placed value of each digit. Seven thousand eight hundred thirty tens and six ones. So the least placed value is of six. Question number eleven. Multiply the sum of three and four by eight and write your answer in words. Sum of three and four means you have to add. Three and four, so three plus four makes it seven. Seven 
into 8 multiply 7 by 8. So let us read the table of 8 children. 8 1s are 8, 8 2s are 16, 8 3s are 24, 8 4s are 32, 8 5s are 40, 8 6s are 48, 8 7s are 56. So we will write this in word. F I F P Y 50 S I X 6 56. Question number 12. 3 more than the smallest 3 digit number. What is the smallest 3 digit number children? Smallest 3 digit number is 100. So 100 plus 3 that makes it 103. Now question number 13. 1 dozen plus 36. 1 dozen equal to 12. So 12 plus 36 makes it 48. Question number 14. How many weeks in a fortnight? A fortnight means 14 days and 1 week equal to 7 days. So how many weeks children? 7 plus 7, 14. So 2 weeks. Question number 15. One more than 19 tenths. What is 19 tenths children? 19 into 10. That makes it 190. 190 plus 1. That makes it 191. Question number 16. Write the sum of the place value and face value of 6 in 7692. So, first we need to know the place value. What is a place value and a face value? Face value is the number itself and place value is the place where the number has been placed. So, 6. You need to know the place value and face value of 6. So for this, we first write the places of the number that is 7600, 9 tens and 2 ones. So the place value of 6 is 600 and the face value is 6. So, 600 plus 6 makes it 606. Question number 17. Form the smallest and greatest four digit number using the given digits. Digits are 5017. You have to form the smallest and greatest four digit number. So, we start with the largest digit over here that is 7, then 5, then 1 and then 0. Now the smallest number. For the smallest number children, do we start with a 0? No, we do not. Why? Because 0 when written in front of a number, it becomes valueless. So we start with 1, 0, 5, 7. Now question number 18. Arrange in ascending order. Now what is ascending order children? Ascending order is arranging the numbers from smaller to the bigger digit. So the smallest one over here is 7000. 69 then 7169 the next smallest digit is yes 7691 so 7691 and the last number is 7916 Now, 
अरेंज इन डिसेंडिंग ऑर्डर वॉट इज डिसेंडिंग ऑर्डर चिल्ड्रेन डिसेंडिंग ऑर्डर इज अरेंजिंग द नंबर फ्रॉम द बिगर नंबर टू द स्मॉलर नंबर नाउ विच इज द बिगर नंबर ओवर हियर सेवन थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड नाइनटी नाइन यस चिल्ड्रेन सो सेवन थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड नाइनटी नाइन फोर थाउजेंड थ्री हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी वन देन थ्री थाउजेंड सिक्स हंड्रेड एंड नाइंटी एंड द लास्ट नंबर इज वन थाउजेंड वन हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी सर्कल द डिविडेंट एंड अंडरलाइन द डिवाइजर now what is a dividend and what is a divisor dividend is the number which you are dividing and divisor is the number with which you are dividing so we will circle the dividend and underline the divisor so circle the dividend and underline this is your divisor so children i hope you understood the sums taught today so based on these worksheets will be uploaded on your school website please go through it and practice well thank you